we can say so this is simple two bus system mm, similar to previous but uh, here uh, uh, only generator and uh, load got included uh, so this is simple two bus system and here if you observe here here some arrow marks came mm. previously we given load is fixed load like uh, 50 megawatt i given so we can't change that load but in this option in this we can change this load uh, for example if i click on this uh, arrow it it's increasing increasing if i down click down click on this arrow mm, it's got decreasing so like this so uh, this customization options also there uh, for that uh, i will tell the procedure how to insert these arrows this thing uh, now what i will do i will run this uh, file for that go keep it in run mode and uh, go to tools click on this green button <clears throat> see if we observe here power is flowing from this bus 1 to bus 2 uh, through this transmission line and here the percentage uh, loading is like some uh, what can say 25 percent only so not overloading so this is the thing this pie chart uh, purpose is uh, for indicating the loading percentage loading of that particular uh, transmission line and uh, see here this animation is looking good but uh, we require data how much uh, flowing from generator to load so those things uh, for that go to this case information and click, click on this model explorer see here in this system we have two buses bus one and bus two uh, at bus one how much is the voltage how much is the per unit capacity how much is the angle those all those data will come at uh, particular bus and here if we click on this generator if we have only one generator at bus one so that at that particular bus one uh, how much it's generating how much it's uh, consuming how much it's taking reactive power all those things uh, will come here and here we have one load if we click on that load see at bus two that uh, load is available and uh, how much it's consuming uh, those things will be there. So this is the simple uh, two bus example. Mm, then now what I will do, uh, I will show one, this is two bus system like that, uh, like this we can go for a three bus system like that. And now I will show what one big system. Uh, this is also, uh, I take it, uh, took it from Duncan Glover sixth edition, chapter six. So see. This is somehow complex system. This is I uh, I triple thirty seven bus system. So thirty seven buses are there here. And uh, see, uh, go to, for running uh, simulation. Go to these tools and click on that green button. So see animation. So this software uh, beauty is uh, for simple system it's okay. For complex system also it will show. Uh, means uh, animation perfectly and which line is overloading which line is uh, underloading those things are uh, it will show and uh, click on this case information if i click on this case information go to model explorer see here uh, go to buses <laughs> total i told you uh, some 37 buses are there so here numbers randomly they given not uh, what can say one two three four five in sequence so uh, means uh, random bus numbers given that's why these numbers are coming 55 40, 47 like that otherwise total buses here only 37 buses uh, so those things and uh, generator uh, here we have uh, one two three four five six seven eight nine nine generators are there uh, so he, at each generator how much is generating those things how much is the voltage those things will be available on line sends how many line sends are there the eight line sends are there and uh, loads <coughs> so total 26 load buses are there out of uh, uh, all these things so 26 uh, those things so whichever data we want we can get it uh, from this case information model explorer 